Hello guys and welcome to Crypto Bull. In this video we are going to review another interesting project which is NFT Metaverse, a project where you can stake your NFTs and where you can make profits. And today we are going to talk about the underground. This is very interesting project which consists of multiple different NFTs but main two NFTs will be two characters. But let's go step by step and let's have a look at this project. There are by blood, these are blood tokens which are used as main fuel behind this project which you can earn, which you can trade, which you can use for different purposes. Stake LP or liquidity pool and get LP guys if you are interested and play to earn game. You can already come in and you can check this out here. Now minting gen 1 play now if you will click there you will get redirected to this page where you can find more information so as there is the white paper if you go to white paper you can read more about this game and how to play it as there is a lot of information there are many different aspects how you can play and how you can earn and how you can make profits as the underground the nft staking game that doesn't pull its punches. Do you have what it takes in the underground? Join us in new strategy games that merges stake to earn DeFi tokenomics with slick hand drawn generative animated artwork. And if you look even at these NFTs, you can already notice that this is professionally made and these are not some auto generated. As you see, guys, these NFTs look very, very professional. Welcome to the underground. The underground is a staking game with stunning algorithmically generated art of unique fighter and Yakuza NFTs. As I mentioned, there are two types of them. There are fighter NFTs and there are Yakuza NFTs. And Yakuza NFTs are much more rarer guys. Earn Blood. Blood is the native token which is built on Ethereum ERC20 tokens. Send your fighter and Yakuza to fight. Staking. When you send them to fight guys, this means that you are pretty much staking these NFTs. They will earn you blood. Blood is that they will earn you these blood tokens and get gold gold is the ultimate price for everyone so there are also gold nfts which are only 1000 but gold doesn't come cheap 1 million blood per gold guys as actually there is 1 million blood tokens per, for one gold nft and there are only 1000 of these gold nfts level up your fighters to earn further and use ring and amulet nfts strategically so there are also these ring and amulet nfts NFTs. You can join their Discord, you can check out their white paper. Like I said, on their white paper, there's a tons of information where everything is described in great detail, as you can see, how you can earn, how you can acquire, and much, much more information. If you are interested, just click in their white paper, guys, as you can see here, guys. And here are the in game items which we were talking about. So, first, like I said, the main two items will be these fighter NFTs and Yakuza NFTs. These will be pretty much a play. NFTs level up your fighter to earn more blood while staked. So when you are staking your fighters, you are earning blood tokens and earn blood by collecting taxes from all staked fighters. This is if you have this Yakuza NFT and there are these blood guys and these blood are actually tokens and there will be 2.5 billion of these blood tokens. You can also check tokenomics here on their website. There are also ring NFTs, amulet NFTs and gold NFTs. Amulets daily level downs by plus three days for all NFTs in your wallet and much more information. And here is the economy of the game. Stake your NFTs wisely guys. In-game items further improve your blood earnings already blood as well guys i hope that you already got that this blood is the token which is built on erc20 so ethereum based higher level fighters earn you more blood higher ranked yakuza collect more blood tax and higher levels are increasingly harder to reach so the more you play pretty much the more you get your nft whether it's a fighter or yakuza at the higher level and when they become higher level they earn you more profits they earn you more blood as the amount of blood you need to burn to purchase the next level increases like xp and diablo guys so those are next level as you can see here guys there is this how this works like you can mint your nfts level up or down trade guys take nfts and you get these golds you can get only these gold nfts only for one million blood 
tokens guys you can't get them in any other way guys and there will be only 1000 of these gold nfts and there will be like i already mentioned 12000 altogether like these fighter and yakuza nfts here is like blood supply guys this is the tokenomics pretty much how they will be distributed in this game and here you can see pretty much the roadmap everyone knows that only the strongest get gold guys and here you can hover these four points as you can see round one fight club opens a day of mint stake fighters and yakuza to earn blood guys and second round by gen one fighters and yakuza with blood and round three level up your fighter to earn more blood and round four get your gold for one million blood so one million blood tokens are required to get gold nft guys and here is the gameplay here is everything described in greater detail guys i will not be reading this as always come in and check this out for yourself but i hope that you get the idea and to me for example personally i find this project very professionally built they have actually already built something like you can see here guys you can already come in and you can browse around this website there's a lots of information and you can already check it out and talking about team we are talented experienced dev team with a history in on-chain staking so this team is already experienced and they already know about staking and they are already in crypto space for a longer time and if you are interested in more frequently asked questions however like i mentioned guys you can find pretty much all information information on their white paper how it works how you can make profits and how you can stay but what is total supply 12,000 gen 0 nfts which are these fighters and which are yakuza nfts and 48,000 gen 1 nfts only mintable with blood guys you can get them only with blood tokens and there are 10 percent of gen 0 and gen 1 nfts will be jacuza guys these jacuza which were to, which we were talking about and 1000 gold nfts only mintable with blood so only acquirable with blood tokens and 2.5 billion blood total supply so yes in general i find this project interesting that's why i decided to review it i see that these nfts look very highly professionally built guys they have already built something that's why i decided to review it here on crypto Bull channel and if you found this video useful leave a like share this video subscribe to my channel if you're new and see you in the next one